Okay, good morning. Let me know if everybody can hear me. Um, let me know if you're there. Can I do A and F today here? Can't see how this doesn't work. I did also rate INTC, which rated fine too. Uh, this is better. Nice volume in this here this morning. Almost shocked that there's a good gap in a Monday. Definitely think Mondays are the hardest days to trade if you don't have me directing you when not to do anything. I haven't looked at anything. I haven't even looked at the market. Let's look at the market. Looked at the market or anything for over a week. Nice break. Um, so market's higher. Market's higher should move higher this week. Let's look at this pie. Buy line means buy its line. definitely higher this week here in the market so had seen a bunch of emails about the market getting toppy or bearish no way no way this looks very very strong here more in the spy than the queues but even still all right so if you want to do this fine uh a and f has a bigger target any questions for the open here one quick trade in this and done and we'll quickly look at this stuff for tonight should be a busy week. Very surprised to get something this good on a Monday. So definitely gonna take advantage of it. Any questions? I put the targets and everything in the room above. Did anyone trade on their own last week? Everybody turn did everybody uh, take off? Anybody do anything? Dubon's took off, good decision. Shower Singer took off, excellent. Shanti traded LD, we can look at that. Took off Cloud and Back, thank you. Traded Futures. Looks like the market was very slow. Even though days was open last week, it looks like it was like doo doo doo. No actual trades, paper trades. That's okay. LB worked. Bob did it too, I guess. We can look at that. I think that this is going to push back first, so we'll just play it by ear here. Good luck, everyone.
Oh, get ready for the noise any second here. <laughs> I hear the guy in the hall. Here he comes. <laughs> Actually, they're going to be remodeling the actual hallway, I think, this week. And I'm like, okay, they can't be any worse than the drilling, so... Painting a wallpaper I can live with. Drilling? That's a different story. Okay, good luck. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Okay, if we do this aggressive, which I'm not saying we are yet, stop's going to be 11.10. So just letting you know, I don't have the entry yet. And that may be changed. Oh, look at this go. Okay, we're going to do... We're going to do 62 by 1110. Here, take it right now. Just get it. Get it right now. Get it in. Get it, get it, get it. Stop is 1110. 1110. 1110. A and F. No hesitation there. There, here it is. In fact, the target is $10. Here, let's take, get it all the way down. That's it. Then we're out. Here. That's this setup way, way faster than I thought. Meaning I thought it would push back. It didn't. It's so crazy weak. Here, you got to be in it. You can still do it here. Put the stop at 1110. And that gives us room. Here, here, here. A and F. Take it if you didn't do it. Here, here, here. Do, 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 do. Actually, I wrote a number. I said 1025. Um, here, we might get out of half if it, if it bounces at 1025. Stay with it. Stay with it. In fact, I am going to get out of half if it bounces at 1025. Let's just see. Oh, I think it's going to 10 now. I think it's going to 10 here. A and F. Hope everyone got it. Can't look at anything else right now. This really, really worked. I mean, it is working. Just, I really think it's going to 10. The question is, is it going to 10? Is it going to 10? If this breaks 50, it's going right to 10. Let's see what happens here. This could get some pushback right in here, but I gave us room. If this breaks 50, I think it's going right to 10. Let's try to hold it. I think it is. I think it's going to break 50. Here. So weak. A and F. Wow. To get a gap like this, to start out our July, to start out the earnings season, this is like... No, it's a sign. On a Monday? After a holiday. Here, A and F, under 50. Things are really looking up. Here, yes, 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 it did. A and F. I think it goes to 10. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Crap, should we get out of half of it, though, if it bounces? Here, let me look at the market. doop a doo Nowheresville. Nowheresville for the market yet. Here, A and F. Sorry. 
Big Fudge got out is the patience of a snail. Or no. <laughs> Wait a minute, that's the opposite. What was I thinking, snail? <laughs> it's the opposite of a snail. <laughs> Here. <laughs> Why did I say snail? I'm thinking of snails. Here, A and F. <laughs> I said snail. It's the opposite of a snail. What's the opposite of a snail? A roadrunner. Here, A and F, under 40. A jackrabbit. Here, A and F. Here, doopa doopa do. Why is it snail? That was funny. 37. <sighs> It's like Seinfeld, George, do the opposite. It's the opposite. What is going on? Gosh, do we hold it? 9.35. Wow, what a nice trade to start off. Do, do, do. Here, A and F. Here, A and F. Here, wow, here it is. Here, A and F, everybody, pay attention. Wow, what a nice trade. No hesitation by me today. I've had my coffee. A and F. Here, go. <laughs> All right, my hand is on the button soon, though. Talk about institutional selling. This is it. Here it is, ANF. Everybody pay attention. One more push and we're out. Wow. There, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. I'm out. I'm not holding it to 10. This is just such a big move right away. I do think it goes to 10 o'clock today. It's up to you. Here, it's still, it's got a little more. I would bar by bar this literally. This will push back sometime here. It's just too big of a move, too fast. If you're still in it, you're literally, your hand is at the button. Two pennies over the number, take it. You, you, this is just a phenomenal move. Phenomenal, phenomenal, phenomenal. I'm not saying it doesn't go to 10 today. It probably does, but I don't know what time. Just what a great move. Excellent. 10.20. 20 cents from the target, close enough. Fit, Susanna made $1,500. Woo, look at you. Trader Lexi's back in the groove. Here, if it breaks 20, you're going to get it all the way down. But I don't know if it happens right here. Anybody still in? Anyone? Anyone at all? Very nice. Big Fudge would be a millionaire several times over if you did the opposite. If you did the opposite of what? Not the opposite of what I do. <laughs> what do you mean, the opposite of what? If you did the opposite today of A&F, you've lost a million dollars. I don't know what you mean by that. Koala bears out a half. Journeywoman's still in it. Pyro 7 of 5 to start the week. Thanks, Melissa. Yep, very good. Oh, your instincts. If you did the opposite of your instincts. But your instincts should be should be what I taught you. You should your instincts should be completely now what I taught you. 1025 was a real target, people. And I was considering holding it to 10, but the bottom line is the move is just was too big, too fast, too huge. And it's going to push back. If it keeps going here, you can stay with it. You know, if you're in this, you really believe it's going to go and you're fine with getting a pushback. 20 was the low. It's got to break it. Journey Woman's still in it. She's getting crazy today. Here, under 23. I don't know what this does right afterwards. Very nice trade. Wow. Wow. Things are really... Whew, had some great news last week. Two pieces of good news. Start out the week this strong. Gosh. All the stars are aligning. <laughs> all of my stars are aligning. 
Finally! Smooth Trader said, nice trade. Did you do it or watch? Here, if you're still in this, 10.35. Put the stop at 10.35. Put the stop at 10.35. If you want a tight, tight stop so you don't lose, could keep going. I'm all out. Seven streams made 296. That's good. Here, A and F. If it goes under 20, it's going to go straight down. But let's just take a look at this, people. This is a big move for the stock. First of all, it's not an earnings gap, which is fine. <clears throat> but I'm just saying, a non here, this is going to break the low. Holy crap. Dubaz, are you still in it? Oh, my goodness. There it goes. Here, this is the exit for everyone. Who's still in it? Get it down, 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 and take it out. This is it. Look, don't let this get away from you. If any of you are still in it, here it goes. Wow. Hold on. Let's look at it. Look at that. Here, it's going to go right down to 10. Do you believe that? Rumi's still in it. That's very unlike you. All right, anyways, let's look at the move here. Yeah, it's going to get to 10. Here. <gasps> Bob's is still in it. Journey woman. You lost me. How, you made a dollar? Here, look. Wow, look at that. It's going to go there. Seriously, people, if anyone's still in it, you got you to take it. This is crazy now. Dirty woman, how could you have made a dollar? It hasn't gone a full, complete dollar. You lost me there. Out at 18, great call. Thank you, Green Maverick. Here's pushback. Again, everyone should be out. All right, let's just go up here and look at this for something because, um, you know, again, wasn't an earnings gap. So happy to see something this great. Normal move on the day for this is 50, 60 cents. Now we did have a good gap. Total move on the day here around 70 something, but we can't expect a move like something like this, you know, $1.60, $1.70, or even something like this, a dollar on a day that's unexpected on an on earnings day. So, you know, I think I did a good job figuring 1025 because, you know, I could have squeezed a little bit more out of this, another 10 cents or so, but, you know, I mean, come on. Wow, what a what a so so for now the schedule is we're doing we're you know we're doing the room five days a week. I've kind of talked to everybody about this a couple of times in the last few months. The room schedule is gonna be changing at some point. I don't know when. And I've been thinking, thinking, thinking about it. Um I think, I think the room schedule is going to change where I'm running the room Monday through Thursday and Friday you guys are on your own because Monday is the hardest day. Friday, I think some of you could trade on your own. I know some of you could trade on your own because there's usually a lot of stuff to do. But, you know, you, I feel like you need my direction more on a Monday because Mondays are hard. They're the hardest day of the week, the, the, the least busiest days of the week, and sometimes the hardest, you know, and... Uh, my schedule is getting more hectic, but there's just no one to replace me. I thought about it, thought about it all, all weekend long. I, I don't think I'll ever hire anyone to help me with the room. It's just impossible. It's better off if I have something scheduled and I have to close it to just close the room because there's there's no one that can call the trades like me, and I don't want people to 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 not do well, you know. And and I, I wish that I wish that one of you could do the room, but I don't think any of you could do the room like me. I mean, if you think that you can, you can email me. And we could talk about it, but I, I don't. I don't think any one of my students could could call the trades like me, even though you do them. To call them in live time and do them at the same time, I know is challenging. So even after today, like to see this today, to know this would work, you know. But Fridays there's usually stuff to do, and I think that you could be on your own in a Friday. Let's just see what happened here with INTC. INTC did set up, but.
33. This is late. So I'm not calling anything here. If you did it on your own, fine, but you missed ANF if you did this, unless you did both. Tight stop for this. This should break the low. 33 is the target here. This is going to be a good trade. Uh, this is going to be 40 cents or so. Not as fast of a mover as ANF, and definitely not as good of a gap. You need me in the room every day. <laughs> I am in the room every day now, but I'm just saying, you know, I'm taking on a bunch of projects and some things are happening. They're all exciting things, though. Um, but in my mind, if I have to juggle my schedule, I think, I think that, uh, I think you need me on a Monday. All right, who wants to go over what? Is anyone on the planet still in this? It actually looks like it's going to try to break the low again. I have no numbers after 10. Here it actually is going to try to do it. 10, 10 is the low. Wow. I, I mean, this could go to 9 something. I mean, psh, look at this. 9.45, 15 minutes, huge move. No reason to be in it at all. I'm not calling it again, but it's four cents from breaking the low again. Here it goes. It's going to do it. Oh, Dabaz is still in it. Wow. He's back into his normal self. <laughs> holding. Speaking of holding, let's look at CMG. This was the option trade. Is anyone still in this or not? Is anyone still in the CMG option trade? Susanna has conviction what? In A&F? Dubaz is not in it anymore. Ooh, I didn't even look at this. So let's see, where did it go last week? Wow, dropped last week to 406. Did you get out there? Green Maverick got out last week. Wow, how much did you make on this Green Maverick? Dubod's got out on this last week. How much did you make on it? This did have a big move. Wow. What about Wednesday? Koala Bear? Green Maverick got out at 407.50. How much did you make? Koala Bear, I don't understand what you're asking me. Oh, you're writing the message. Okay. Uh, Dubaz and Green Maverick were the only two that, that stayed in this to the drop down in there, which happened last week, which apparently was the six. You made 75% profit. Dubaz only had one contract. That's still fine. There's nothing wrong with that. It's okay. It's profit. What did the market do that day? So that was the six. Yeah. That was a good exit. Definitely a good exit because the market's rallying, but I still think it's lower, but that was a good exit point. Yes, definitely. And here this is. ANF getting close to the $10 number. Dubaz is still in it. Anyone else? Beautiful, beautiful trade. This actually looks like it could break 10, but very happy for the day. Any questions from anyone about anything else? Anyone still in this besides Dubaz? Koala Bear wants to go over Tesla very well from last week. Okie doke. Look at this thing. You stinker. Look at it. It is going to get a 10. <sighs> Look at this thing. Here, it's going to break 10. Wow. Holy guacamoles. 975, 980. Did your anyone went back in? Here, ANF. It's going to break 10. If you're still in this, though, seriously, seriously, people. Dubod's got out. All right. <laughs> and Journey Woman, I would have your hand on the button, too, if you took it again. She took it again, even though I didn't call it again. She went nuts. Journey Woman's going to have a good earnings season. 
No, I don't, I don't, I don't trail stuff. If you want to do that, you can do it in your own. All right, uh, whatchamacallit? Koala Bear wants to go over Tesla. <sighs> what's, what's the situation? I know this got last week, as somebody else told me. Um, what's your question here? What's your question? What's your question here, Koala Bear? Fell, did you do it? I mean, did you, did you day trade this last week? Is that what you're saying? I I mean, you know, obviously I was off last week, but I don't think this would have rated well. Did it fall? Yes. Did it fall through here? Yes. Do I think this would have rated well the other day? Probably not. It might've been on the cusp. Did anyone short Tesla? I don't, there's nothing to do here. No, I'm not calling any options trades here and you know, it's, it's having some sell-off. But remember, the market really didn't go anywhere the last week. Some people were reading the market as bearish. It's not. That move even in the last week or 10 days was not. But, you know, again, I think there was news here or something because someone else mentioned it. Do I think this is falling off a cliff? No. But there's nothing to do here now. Be sure this here, you made money. Be sure this here, you made money. I There's no way I would have done that. Let's just take a look at everything a little bit here. I don't know what you want me to say about Tesla quality. I just gave you my read on that. But other than that, I don't know if you had a specific question. My opinion on Tesla is that it's had two gaps. You could have day traded them, but I wouldn't have done any overnights in them. And the chances of me day trading that are zero, so I wouldn't have done them. Um, so let me just look at everything else. I mean, if you traded last weekend, did Tesla as a short, you made money. But I'm not sure the gap would have rated well. If it would have been, if, if anything would have been a close fall and you had been looking for stuff to do or you would have watched it into the open. Melissa, good morning. Welcome back. Great trade. I hope you keep doing the trading room every day. You never do as well by yourself as you do with me. You need you. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to keep doing the room, but I'm saying my schedule, my schedule is going to be changing. I don't know what that is yet. I'm just, I've been talking about it for months though. But it's, you know. There's nobody that can that can run the room and take my place. So if there's days where I can't do it, it's the room will have to be closed. It's just there's no way around it because I can't I can't get anyone to replace me. It's just it's, it, it doesn't exist. But the days that I can't, you, you know, you practice on your own, and and I think that's good. I think it's fine. I mean, last week if you traded here, we'll look at the LB. You got some experience on your own. I do think it was a good time to take off though because the market was slow. Here, let's look at this thing here. Uh, Amazon. Mm. I think this, everything has earnings, what, in two weeks? All right, let's look at the LB. I think it's the end of the month, the yeah, last week of the July for the Amazon and Google. I'll have to look it up. LB. Okay. So some people did it, some people didn't. Ooh, it worked. It was a good one. LB on the 6th. Okay, you tell me, those of you that did it, I'm not going to say, what did you do? What was your entry in this, the LB? Anybody want to tell me where you did it? We'll go over it. Anyone want to tell me what you did with this last week on your own, if you did it? Clearly it worked. Moved more than a buck. Nice entry here. Bob did it. Shanti did it. You want to tell me what you did? 